<laughs> oh, there he is. Hey, good morning, day two. So here's a little recap of what's going on. Bronco is uh, in pretty good shape. The new skid plate tested a few times already. Pretty hard. A little bolt protector has helped. The electrical tape has been holding up pretty good. Jonathan's Bronco got the winch cable holding up, uh, holding forward the rear axle, and uh, had to take the pinion out. It's just the ring gear now. Uh, this is all binding up and everything, and just wasn't good, so I had to pull that out. But the track bar held up, which is actually really good. Those heim joints helped out, keep them from breaking. Um, but yeah, I mean, we got real lucky with this one. We were able to make it back to camp and not uh, not be stranded out there. Other fog shocks, no issues at the top here. But uh, down here, ooh, those eyelets are busted. Both sides. But the shafts and everything, the housing held up pretty good. So good on you, Fox. Opinion. Snap clean off. Um, yeah, I mean, that <laughs> is what it is. And pulled the drive shaft, pulled her right out of the slip yoke. We got a busted U joint here, um, which is actually a that's a decent place to break, um, as opposed to you know the yoke of the flanges. So, uh, but yeah, there's the uh, inside of the pinion there. Carnage, fun times. This view right here is worth the trip alone. And we just happened to stumble upon this little gem of a play area. this way.
<laughs> there are certain situations where you know you need rock sliders. This is one of them. Heavy metal off-road rock sliders in action. Only the best. Passenger. When in doubt, throttle out. getting under an undercut. He's got a cool line over here.
the near future, JVF off-road here in Fabrication is going to recommend heavy metal off-road to build some heavy-duty headlight guards. I think it would be wise for his Bronco. Go passenger. Yeah, I can't turn. Okay. Keep them just go straight where they're at. Well, I tried climbing this uh, this rock wall here, and uh, well, I gave it a really good effort. I probably tried about I don't know seven times or so, going in straight, coming at different angles. These tires, the uh, the Ball Pro XS from Mickey Thompson, man, they just, they grab and they bite and they just eat it all up. And I was climbing these walls, no problem, but man, just all this loose stuff just kept kicking out and almost hit my passenger in the face. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> and uh, shit, I mean, yeah, I just couldn't do it, but man, it's, it, it's fun. And you can see, look how tall that thing is, man. Uh, that's, that's no easy feat right there. Well, I'm just driving down the trail here and happen to find some huckleberries. Huckleberry bush. Well, it's 5.30 a.m. and we are heading back. Uh, boy, it's been a fun trip. Um, <laughs> too bad. Uh, Jonathan, he, uh, he ended up breaking his Bronco, but, um, you know, we still had a good time regardless, so... Anyway, see you next time.